Good evening, I'm Shogun Mohammed, and this is the 11 o'clock news. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister, Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, attended the horse race meeting held for his cup this afternoon at the Rashid Equestrian and Horse Racing Club track. Upon his arrival, His Royal Highness the Crown Prince was welcomed by the Vice Chairman of the Supreme Committee of the Rashid Equestrian and Horse Racing Club, His Highness Sheikh Isa bin Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, and His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa. Also present were Sheikh Sultan al-Din bin Muhammad bin Salman al-Khalifa, Sheikh Khalid bin Ali bin Isa al-Khalifa, Sheikh Hamad bin Abdullah bin Isa al-Khalifa, Sheikh Salman bin Muhammad bin Isa al-Khalifa, Sheikh Khalifa bin Ali bin Isa al-Khalifa, Sheikh Isa bin Abdullah bin Isa al-Khalifa, dignitaries, diplomats accredited to the kingdom and a large audience of horse racing enthusiasts. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince praised the Supreme Committee of the Rashid Equestrian and Horse Racing Club, chaired by His Highness Sheikh Abdullah bin Isa bin Salman Al Khalifa, for their hard work in preparing and organizing the horse racing season. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince noted the enthusiasm of the distinguished crowd in attendance, pointing out that their excitement was testament to the high quality and competitiveness of the racing. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince went on to praise the youth of Bahrain for their enthusiastic preservation of equestrian expertise noting that their hard work does much to preserve the Kingdom of Bahrain's international reputation in the sports. At the end of the race, His Royal Highness the Crown Prince congratulated the winners and presented the cup of the Supreme Committee of the club to Sheikh Khalid bin Ali Al Khalifa, the Oaks Al Bahrain Cup to Fawzi Abdullah Nos, the Crown Prince's Cup for Arabian Horses to Abdullah Kuwaiti, the Crown Prince's Cup for Locally Bred Horses to Sheikh Salman bin Muhammad Al Khalifa, and the Crown Prince's Cup for Imported Horses to Sheikh Isa bin Salman Al Khalifa.
personal representative of His Majesty the King for Charity Work and Youth Affairs, President of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, and Chairman of the Bahrain Olympic Committee, His Highness Sheikh Nasr bin Hamad Al Khalifa, achieved the winning title in the Ironman Triple Crown race in Dubai with the participation of more than 2,500 athletes representing 100 countries. His Highness said that this achievement will further motivate him in the coming races, the Triathlon World Championship that will be held in Hawaii next October. He affirmed his keenness to participate in local and international races to be fully prepared for the coming race in Hawaii. He praised the Bahraini participation in Dubai's race and affirmed that the positive result was achieved thanks to the high spirit of the team. He praised the efforts of the team and stressed that this experience will further enhance the performance level of the team. His Highness affirmed that the aim of all international participation is to showcase the high status of the kingdom in the triathlon sports. The representative of His Majesty the King for Charity Work and Youth Affairs, President of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, and Chairman of the Bahrain Olympic Committee, His Highness Sheikh Nasr bin Hamad Al Khalifa, deputized the first Deputy President of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, President of Bahrain Athletics Association, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa, to attend the ceremony of the Mazayan Nasr bin Hamad contest for falconry held in Sabha. The ceremony was attended by Sheikh Ahmed bin Muhammad Al Khalifa, the Minister of Youth and Sports Affairs Hisham bin Muhammad Al Jodar, the Assistant General Secretary of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, and the General Secretary of the Bahrain Olympic Committee, Abdurrahman Askar, members of the royal family and participants in the contest. His Highness Sheikh Khalid expressed pride in the outstanding efforts of His Highness Sheikh Nasr in achieving the visions and directives of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa to establish the principles of the Arab identity through the falconry and hunting contest, hailing the wide participation of the events. His Highness Sheikh Khalid congratulated His Highness Sheikh Nasr on the success of the contest, affirming its achievements of His Highness's aspirations and goals to support falcon owners in developing their skills and abilities and to promote the nat traditional sport. He expressed appreciation for the efforts of the Supreme Organizing Committee, headed by Khalifa Abdullah Al Gaud, and the participating committees, as well as the efforts of the media in promoting the championship. His Highness then honored the winners and sponsors of the competition.
The president of the Bahrain Authority for Culture and Antiquities, Sheikh Amey bint Mohammed Al Khalifa, opened the ninth edition of the annual Ta al Shabab Youth Festival. Supported by Temkin, this year's festival is being held as Bahrain celebrates the city of Muharraq as the 2018 capital of Islamic culture for the Arab region. The festival focuses on a wide range of cultural pursuits, including literature, fine arts, poetry, theater, music, architecture, technology, and human sciences. Ta'a Shabab activities include workshops, debates, lectures, art exhibitions, musical and theatrical shows, as well as open forums to encourage public discourse. These activities are all run by volunteers, each of which focuses on a particular cultural aspect as it pertains to the youth. And before we end the news, here is a reminder of the top stories. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince praises Bahraini youth for their enthusiastic preservation of equestrian expertise and their efforts to develop sports in the kingdom. And His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad achieves the winning title in the Ironman Triple Crown race in Dubai with the participation of more than 2,500 athletes. And that's all from Bahrain International's News Centre. From all the news team and myself, Shogun Mohammed, goodbye.